Hi everyone, welcome to Flip Chart Friday. I'm James with Sequis, and today we're talking about speed. No, I'm not talking about that sweet movie with Keanu Reeves and Sandra Bullock and Dennis Hopper. Nope, instead today we're talking about sight speed. So there's been a lot of studies done uh, and they've noticed that about 53% of users will bounce if the load of your, the load time of your site takes over three seconds. Um, so that also has to do a lot with your rankings in Google. If you have a slow site speed, site being irrelevant for that specific search term. So we need to make sure that we've got a fast site, converting and not jumping immediately. So <clears throat> some common issues that people have that they don't immediately think about. Uh, the first one is images. Right? Size matters. So sometimes people will have, they'll have a beautiful, huge image. It'll be two feet by three feet, you know, and that'll scale down and it'll have amazing resolution on a screen. That's great. It looks great, but it significantly slows down your site. So what we want to do is make sure that your image size matches the, uh, the resolution and also that we're compressing those. So using a program like gzip or, or any kind of program that's going to compress those down and make it uh, load faster for the end user, for your customer. Next thing is a head. Now that is basically the building blocks of your page. You know, that's going to contain a whole lot of information that's going to um, help the page eventually to load properly. So one thing that people don't think about is using custom fonts. Now, custom fonts, again, they might be really cool or, or really uh, interesting to use, but those could be significantly slowing down your site as well. Um, another thing, and this is kind of technical, but CSS and JavaScript files in that head section. That's something that you want to talk to your developer about, making sure that they don't have too many of these files or, and also that they're minified. The last thing that we're going to talk about is testing. Testing, testing, always testing. That's something that we do here at Sequest. We make sure that we use programs like GT Metrics or Google PageSpeed Insights. Um, we want to make sure that, that we have optimal site speed, that there's no issues that come up. And so whenever we're going through a new site or working on any of our client sites, we do use these uh, sites to do that. Um, and each one is going to kind of give you a list of things that you can do. So you could either take that to your developer or you could talk to us here at Sequist and we can kind of help you um, minimize some of the common issues that these sites will bring up. So <clears throat> that's everything. Uh, it's kind of a rough overview of some of the most overlooked speed issues on a site. Uh, again, I'm James at Sequist and thanks for, thanks for watching.